Hello, hello, and welcome back to me trying out my anodons and failing horribly. Let's get to it. So, <clears throat> I need to get this going. And, uh, but by the way, this is Moss Farm. And, uh, I found out. that to get that going I need to find some moss and rocks have a small chance of giving me moss so I have to go around and look on some rocks until I find some moss this is riveting the best <clears throat> so this is gonna be interesting um, that was just stone That was that was a stone. Uh yeah yeah. Find this RNG a little bit uh, interesting. I'll just call it interesting here. Let's try this. This is that one. Oh, yeah, that's right. It doesn't work. Yep. Trees. Big rock over there. Big quartz vein. So, sure. All right, let's see what happens. Is sit here, grinding out some stone, and totally riveting content. I remember I will make give myself some stone because I heard some moss. It's just dumb. Dumb way of doing that. That that's mm. I would have been okay with every rock giving you one moss. It's no, it's not like a that big of a deal. They're almost trying to make this kinda like you well, standing on it, kinda like uranium mining where you mine uranium you get the chance of getting one of the higher tier ones. Once you have enough, you process it through cover X to get more of the higher tier ones. This is kind of what they're doing. So you get one piece of moss. You have to insert it into the moss thing. That moss thing will slowly make more over time. And it's a positive feedback loop. So you get more moss. You're able to uh, um, make more of the material. So it's it's a very interesting concept and I get why they did it. But the problem is, is that this is not exactly very fun to do. Just sitting around beating on rocks until you get one singular piece of moss. And it's not like something you can say, well, okay, well, you know what? I'll wait till I have bots. That way it's something simpler to do. Um, because you can't get to bots without doing it. I mean, you need the moss. And this is something that I was noticing. I was reading on some of the Pyanodon stuff. So the, I think this is, this is part of the alien science or alien organism, something like that. And he does suggest that if you're playing with uh, biters, you shouldn't play with the, this, this part of the Pyanodons thing. 
Um, because you're going to be way too slow and you're never going to get to the right amount of science by the time you get attacked by biters. So there's a little bit of an iffiness there. Um, I, I don't know. I'm definitely keeping it. I think that what might end up happening is if we get totally and absolutely destroyed, then we might have to go to peaceful mode. Just so that it's... Oh, there, one boss. Okay. Just so that it's... Uh, what's it called? Oh, we got a power issue. <clears throat> Just so that it's something that I can play without having to worry about having my factory destroyed every five seconds. Not to swallow on that. Should probably go take it easy on the seaweed since I'm gonna need it to. Uh... So you do that. Now it needs power. And now it's basically gonna produce moss very slowly. And that moss it produces, you put it in here. So it's very interesting what it's doing. I just. Um... Yeah, I don't know. It, it, it's uh, one of those things where it's a little weird. Let's do a seaweed thing. Uh, seaweed. Seaweed crop facility. Oh, God, I need more simple circuit boards. I think I'm going to have to expand copper. Oh, this thing's chewing through. It's not good. I have to switch these guys to, uh... Yeah. It's chewing through the power way too fast. Or the call. Oh, let's see here. I can't make any... Still can't make any. And it's because small parts... need a uh, proper look at that still can't make it but two more Let's, let's redo this really quick. Exactly made the best. So this stuff can't be pulled up unless I have acetylene. That's fine. to try to like avoid touching it still damn it see if I touch it there it's gonna okay now I wonder if because it doesn't have the if it just won't mine the titanium Let's find out. I don't know if that works that way. I've never had to test that because it's never been a consideration in uh, in vanilla games. By the time you're expanding that much, you clearly, you know, are in need of a... Uh, Let me see. <laughs> Seems to be fine. And I guess we'll know 100% whenever it blocks up, will we? 
Because if it does work that way, then I can get more out of this patch by basically moving stuff closer. Just kind of... Yeah, it seems to be working. Let's see. Need way more copper, that's for sure. some more of this stuff here so now should do it a lot faster oh yeah. yeah okay see so it's it the more of it you have the faster it moves that's that's good make a seaweed thing so that I don't use up all my seaweed Oh my god, it's enormous. Okay. Needs water. It's fine, we can get some water to you. We need um I don't know why that there's some water. And give me that. It also needs power. Cool little animations. All right, we finally have a uh, usable moss factory thing. See how much slower it is. It's, it's it's a very interesting concept, right? It's like okay, well, you need to get your first sample and then build it up from there. Um. So in in that sense, it's not bad. It's just odd. Okay, so. All right. Um. So what were we doing? Okay. So we needed to make rubber stoppers, which need wool and latex. Latex needs latex slabs and steam. Sodium alginate, formic acid, and creamy latex. Limestone sap. Okay, we need to deal with sap now. So sap seeds, sap tree, sap extractor. Automate sap extraction. Tapping and piercing are also used. Yeah, whatever. So let's um like this. Sap. It's literally in one place. Okay. A lot of little build, little uh, no, not little, but a lot of uh, different buildings to get stuff done. It's it's interesting. Right, let's see. So this also needs sap, from what I understand. Oh my god. So well, maybe not. We can insert modules into this. So do you need a sap tree? I don't. I need to plant it. Sap trees. How do, how do I make a sap tree? Oh, I need to find um, botanical nurse. Oh. Botanical. I need a fuck ton of wood. Okay, let's go get a fuck ton of wood. Apparently, I need more sap as well.
Oh, riveting, riveting. Yeah, I got a little more sap. And I needed, what was it, 50? I think 50 trees. Um, botanical. Not enough ingredients. What am I missing? Glass. I need some glass. Okay, we got some glass makers up here. Kind of. Um, I'll switch that recipe to that. So I think I'm using up all the coal gas. Or I'm not using it. I don't know. Right, I never, uh, never did the thing. These buildings are really far apart, too. Let's do box. Not the ideal ratio I would have wanted. Let's put it that way. I'm stupid. What am I doing? Um. weird mess that I'm making here, I know. The problem I'm going to have is this is going to pull. Yeah. I think I'm going to have to switch this to this. And then this. Yep, there it is. Yeah, no, this is gonna work. to switch to putting a flare stack over here because this thing is not using it fast enough. Stupid idea.
open. We need a glass and glass. Back to Martin. Was it that I was getting? This thing. Botanical nursery. Another super expensive um, thing. Botanical. Let's see what this is all about. Make sap seeds from sap. And I can make sap tree from sap seeds. You get two sap seeds per sap. <laughs> That's uh I need twelve point five sap. Which is actually not accurate. Need more. Why am I putting these so far apart? I just noticed. You just put them together. No, you know. Let's go kick some trees. Wait, not kick. Let's cut some trees. Yes. That is a rock. That is another rock. Fine. A rock. You sat. No, no, sat. Might as much, I still need the wood, but, you know. I need to cut down so many damn trees. For this RNG-based system is kind of annoying. I don't know, I want to freaking cut down the damn trees for fuel. Oh, there's another sap. Get it, sap. I should be making some sap seeds. Which I need five sap seeds to make a sap tree. There's another two. Thing I didn't uh, reduce the amount of trees like I normally would, I would have been screwed. up this chance. It was ridiculous.
went through a bit of a renaissance there. Just, just got a bunch of them for a second. I need three more. Kind of annoyed that I'm getting rid of the one thing that was getting rid of pollution for me. Which was this little tiny tree farm down here. Come on! Come on! Doesn't make for a very uh, fun beginning. So I needed two or three, I don't remember now. Appreciate that they upped the stack size for things. Because if not, this would have sucked. Since everything's so damn expensive. Come on. Sat me. And I'm getting some bad RNG here. There's also a chance to get seeds off the bat, but how uh, rare are those going to be? <laughs> the fact that it doesn't go down enough decimal places should already tell you how rare they are. So, personal opinion. The seeds should be as rare as the sap is. Oh my god! <laughs> it gives you five though, okay, okay. Okay, not not as bad. It gives you five seeds, so you can already start a tree with that. So there's an option there, I guess. Let's change this here. Wow, that is slow. What are we doing on power? Ah, eh, power's not too bad. All right, so. Creamy latex, and sap, and limestone. So I need my soil extractor down here to change to limestone. And that creamy latex is going to be made where? In a washer plant. Oops. So I need another washer plant. Saline. Okay. Let me get this tree. Thank you. How does this tree work? A tree that naturally produces that useful resin. You just place it. No, I'm pretty sure you got to put it in here. Yep, yeah, there it goes. And it needs power. How slow is it? It seems decently slow. But it's better than uh, having to do it manually, I guess. Where's my... Oh, that's right. I was boxing it. There's a decent amount of moss there, too. Okay. Wait. Why am I still getting ghosts? Did I not make it? That's because that's not a washer plant, you dodo. Oh, fuck. I made a washer plant. I didn't need... Oh, well. Uh, saline. Creamy latex. So you also need water. Okay, so that sounds like I'm going to have to make a uh, separate line of machines down here. Um, your soil extractor. Let's start down here. Wish we get some moss. I'm gonna laugh. Alright. 
the washer plant. Where's the pipe on this thing? Oh, it's got two inputs. Or it's got two. Never mind. Where does this end up? About the same place. And I think I'm gonna make another. Those pumps are expensive. Uh, maybe I shouldn't, but I did. Uh, all right. We need to make some limestone. You're gonna make some of this. Why do I keep doing this? I don't understand myself right now. I keep putting them so far apart. It's probably because they don't have like a reg regular hitbox. The hitbox is weird. Ah. Let's do this. Put a power pole here. Sure. Give you all that limestone. We're doing on sap here. Okay, I finally got five. I can come over here and make another uh, set of seeds. We're getting to another tree to, you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Alrighty, but we got the botanical nursery, the sap extractor, we got this washer thing up. A couple things. I'm gonna call it there because my lapse episode was way too friggin' long because I was carried away. Anyways, see y'all later. Peace.